spot those type of characters, you know, that, that are big old tricks, you know, they ain't got an ounce of game in them. How can you're asking how can we spot those type of men? Yeah, because you know some women that they can't peep that, you know, they think that this person just wants to be around them, but they just want to, you know, spin on them so they can, you know, get them in the bedroom and that'll be about it. They ain't got nothing else to bring to the table, but okay, how, how, how long can I have before, you know, I got money, it's, that's that's not even the case, or, or let me fly you out, you know, them them type of cats, th them type of brothers that want to fly you out, have their wicked wild way with you. You usually tell from John, you know, when, uh, for me, this is what I do, I hate telling a guy my likes, my dislikes, and so forth, because I want him to genuinely figure me out. Yeah, you want him to pick up on Right, because I feel like when you tell a guy, you know, everything about you, your likes, your dislikes, your attributes, so forth, then they kind of know, you know, what to go for, and I don't feel like it's genuine, yeah. you know what I'm yeah, so it comes like do it every, Right, they're going to do everything that you expect, you know what I'm saying, and you can usually spot a trick because, you know, they're ready to fly you out, they're buying you gifts early on, you know what I'm saying, you're kind of like um, a trophy to say, I've been guilty, I've been flown out, you know what I'm saying, I've been showered with gifts, you know what I'm saying, and, you know, I accepted it, I knew what the situation was, okay. for what it was worth, my younger days, let me, let me say that, in my younger days, <laughs> All right. All right. you know, it, it's, I, Like there's no honor to that, you know, and I feel like women were so quick to call men, 
you know, assholes and no good, but sometimes we turn good men into assholes. You know what I'm saying? Like sometimes, you know, there are there are a lot of good men, good men out there in relationships, but because us women don't honor each other, you know, it's hard for men to fight temptation. And you know, back in the days, it was allowed for men to have several wives. A lot of people don't know that, but it's true. Like we, men were allowed to have more than one wife. You know what I'm saying? So if we don't even, if we don't give a, a damn about, you know, respecting each other, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, why, why should you feel any type of way when it comes back on you? True. You know what I'm saying? I, it, it doesn't make any sense. I do, and I, I do feel like women, we can change good men into shitty men. You know, uh, a, a, a man is only going to resist for so long. And then when he feeds into it, oh, it's his fault. It's his fault. It's his fault. You know what I'm saying? But it's like, as a woman, as a respectable woman, you know, do you take blame for that too? Like, how do you look at yourself? The onus is on a person. What do you really feel for this person? Do, do you respect yourself enough not to put the person that you're, you know, encountering basically in harm's way? Because, you know, things can come about with, with, with uh, you know, you're messing with somebody else and you don't know how that person's gonna react once they find that out. You know, you can, you can actually get somebody hurt behind that kind of stuff. Both ways, women and men. Right, mm, I agree. I totally agree. You know, I was just gonna say, it's like, you know, this generation, we're, we're in a generation that's 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 do this and do that like they're normalizing this it's crazy to, like my mom is still married <laughs> to my father i have five sisters we all it's all in marriage she had all her kids in marriage it's rare that you see that now mm -hmm. i don't know if you listen to the, that the last video i sent you but uh essentially Fallon jones she said uh no and nowadays now now it ain't even relationships no more it's like person got the situation like you know this person they just may want to have sex with you occasionally but it, it doesn't go any further than that they don't really want to make no time with you or anything it's sad but it's true it's i agree mm. I, I agree with that mm. if it, there's no hope left mm. because no no one wants to get played no one wants to look like a fool no one wants to commit themselves to someone that could break their heart and leave it in a million pieces Four, seven. Four, seven.